This game contains scenes of explicit violence and gore. It does? But what? Why and where and when? Resident Evil 3. Wow. <laughs> Nemesis. Alrighty. New game. 1999. Hard or easy? Hmm. Anybody know what the differences are? Is easy too easy? Easy is super easy? Oh, okay, screw that then. Resident Evil. Screw that. It all began as an ordinary day in September. An ordinary day in Raccoon City. Raccoon? A city controlled by Umbrella. No one dared to oppose them. And that lack of strength would ultimately lead to their destruction. I suppose they had to suffer the consequences of their actions. But there would be no forgiveness. If only they had had the courage to fight. It's true that once the wheels of justice begin to turn, nothing can stop them. Nothing. It was Raccoon City's last chance. And my last chance. My last escape. Does anyone else say Raccoon like that? I say Raccoon. This is Chopper Delta. Preparing to drop off at area E95070. Look at all the brads! Oh, wow. What are they? No! <laughs> yeah. Boo. <laughs> Too many zombies. My last chance to survive. This is my last escape. Jill, you look so slutty. All right. Uh Whoa. Whoa, check it out. What the heck is this? A reloading tool? What? A tool used to load mixed material into an empty bullet. Oh. Gunpowder? Oh, that's right! You didn't- you guys say that there's like crafting and stuff in this game? <laughs> Slutty Jill. Also, she cut her hair in this game. She had long hair in the first game. Game Insta. Game instructions. This explains about various actions, operations on map screen, and operations in the event scenes. Oh. You can shoot objects such as drums and bombs. Press R2 to aim directly at these objects. 
You can perform quick 180 degree turns. Press the run button while retreating. Oh my god. When you've trapped, when you're trapped by enemies, you can push them away to escape. Press the directional buttons plus action. Cancel button, run button, R1, R2, and L2 buttons rapidly. Hey, there's the button mash that we all didn't know. <laughs> action, cancel, run, R1, R2, and L1. All of those. Press all of those. <laughs> Just before an enemy attacks, you can perform a dodge move to evade it. Press the R1 or R2 buttons. Press the action button while aiming. What? Oh my god. Getting on or off an object. You can get on or off certain objects that appear in the game. Press the action button while you are moving forward to the edge of the object that you wish to get on or off. Press L2 to view the map. Oh, nice, a map shortcut. You can zoom in or out of the map by pressing the action button. While the map is zoomed in, use the directional buttons to move the screen. Press the select button to switch between maps. God, this is such a different game. Shit. <laughs> I'm not... Ugh. It's gonna be rough. It's all new. Everything's new. At certain points in the game, the screen fades into black and white. At these points, you'll be prompted to choose between two different options. The directional buttons to move between options. So use the action button to make your decision. It is possible to skip certain scenes. Press the select button to skip these scenes. Oh my god, you guys. Holy butts. Instructions on the creation of bullets. This explains how to use the gunpowder and the reloading tool. To create various ammunition, you need to use the reloading tool and the gunpowder. That is a necessary item if you want to create different types of ammo. By combining the gunpowder and reloading tool, various types of ammunition will be created. Mix materials to create various types of ammunition. There are three types of basic gunpowders, A, B, and C. Please note that gunpowder C is created by mixing A and B types. Okay. You can create various kinds of bullets by mixing different gunpowders. There are 13 different kinds of gunpowders in all. Okay. If you combine certain types of gunpowder with grenade rounds, special types of grenade rounds will be created. If you repeatedly create the same kind of ammunition, your skill will be improved and you will be able to create more powder. What the frick? Um, okay. I think we need to... No, no, not you! Ah! How many bullets do you take? Oh my god! I only have three left! Uh, you better go in there, Jill. Jill? Why the hell is she wearing that outfit? <laughs> September 28th, daylight. The monsters have overtaken the city. Somehow. I'm still alive. She was undercover as a prostitute when this happened. Must be. She learned from Ada. <laughs> okay. We've got to get out of here. What? What do you think you're talking about? What do you think you're I just talking lost about? my daughter out there. How dare you tell me to go back outside? I'm sorry about your daughter. But there isn't going to be any rescue. We have to get out of here. No! I'm not going anywhere. I'd rather starve to death in here than be eaten by one of those undead monsters. Now leave me alone! <laughs> okay, I mean, feel free to get eaten by a monster if you want. Because that's what's going to happen.
Told you. I'm not leaving. Never. <laughs> Never. Just get away from me. All right. Well, we don't even need him, Jill. Don't worry about it. He's he's just uh, some random idiot. The alarm has already been used. What's this? Healing spray. You know what I really need though? Some more bullets. Bullets. Thank you. Nope, this is on the this is a PlayStation 3 version. It's the back door exit, it's locked. Uh, below my camera it says Resident Evil 2. Oh, you're right. Shit. I forgot about that. Wait. Let me get- let me see if I can find a quick... Logo. Similar logo. No, not two. There we go. Rims. Okay, RE3 logo. Ba ba ba. Boop. There we go. Fixed. Thank you for, for reminding me about that. <laughs> Logo hype. Yay. Ta -da -da -da. Okay. Let's go in here. Will you take the warehouse key? Yes, I will. Thank you so much. Yeah, I know. I meant to do combine. I, I went down too because that's what it's like in the other games. <laughs> hey, oh, this is a save room. Tape. Increments three. Oh. Jill is so spoiled. I see some in there. Jill, there's some there's definitely something there. Look look at that thing. It's a shiny thing. You know you want it. There we go. Gunpowder A. I that's cool. Uh, so does that mean if I combine this with this? Oh. Okay. Cool. Neato. Save the game. Memory card one! Fresh. The Brad card. Easy mode has unlimited increments. Good grief, that is easy mode. 
I mean, that that's cool though. You got to appreciate you got to appreciate it cuz that means that people that don't like this the real the survival mechanics as much can still have fun playing the game, right? Some people don't like that kind of stuff as much. But I personally think that it's a huge part of the game. <clears throat> Definitely adds to it, to the suspense of the gameplay. G Brad, if you could, if you combine A plus A plus A, you get more bullets per jar, but you don't get experience of mixing. Oh right, because you get skills. Is there somewhere that like says my skills? Files? Oh. Is it just kind of in the background somewhere? Oh. Whoa, I don't have to activate the stairs? This is a high class Resident Evil engine. You can just walk right down. Okay, I already went back there. A forklift for moving various types of cargo. Experience is used in late game enhanced ammo, by the way. It's in the background, okay. This game is entering the modern era. It so is. This container is locked from inside. <clears throat> well, I have a key for something. Did I go this way yet? There we go. Yes, I will discard it. Go out. Oh yeah, I should practice some of the move, the sweet moves. I don't know. I don't even remember what the keys were. <laughs> I don't remember at all. Ah, <sighs> quick turn. Press run while retreating. Oh, so like walking backwards. Wait. Uh, I guess. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, you just, well, you have to be walking backwards, but then you can turn around. Well, that's going to be handy if I can remember to use it. There's nothing strange. Just a bicycle. Bicycles aren't strange. Door cutscenes. Oh, it wouldn't be Resident Evil without door cutscenes. Drippy drip. This game must not be too much newer than Resident Evil 2, right? Man, they were they, they all look fairly similar. Like obviously this one is more advanced, but they're all they all kind of like look similar. So it must be they must have just been like cranking them out. Hi. How are you, sir? Oh god, Jill. <laughs> okay. This guy's going to wake up. No, he didn't. Okay, cool. Does he have something I want then? Oh, he did wake up. Oh, okay, fine. Park hours. Uh-huh. Well, this is a familiar looking scene, isn't it? I think I saw a zombie there. Is this anything? A wrecked car is blocking the way. Excuse me. Ooh, plants. Any plants for Jill? Graphics and sounds are improved. Yes. One year later. Aha. Okay. That's not the right thing. <laughs> I feel like there was a way I didn't go. Hold on. This game was meant to be a spin-off, really. It's 
It's locked from the other side. Okay. Huh. And L2 is the map. I love that there's a map shortcut. That's great. <clears throat> so that's the locked one, and then those are blocked off. Okay. You can do a lot with the same engine. That kind of the point, having one code base and just tweaking it. Yep. <laughs> that is done a lot. Hello, plants. Some things never change, though, of course. <laughs> Jill may look sluttier, but the plants are still the same. Oh, wait, there's a door here. <laughs> Shit, man. That's a lot of zombies. Yeah, this game has... Uh, the controls are very smooth. I did notice that. Hello, sir. I just... <laughs> I don't remember I can just hit that button. Okay. Um Why is this purple? What is this purple room? Uh And it's great that we can scroll on the map because then I can like tell you guys what room I'm talking about. <laughs> is this where I came from? Yeah, this is the bike room. Okay. Uh, I thought I could just, uh, you know, leave you hanging out there. It was not the case. Yeah. Hmm. Alright, well, I think I've already been here, so I'm just gonna, you know, mosey on back this way. Wait, who was that? Oh, you mean the zombies? Just, there's just some run-of-the-mill zombies. Hey, guys. There's a lot, lots less of them now, though. I can't see. Oh! Ah, oh, frick! Get down! Okay, go. Whoa! Oh shit. Oh uh, god, it's a little cramped in here. It's a wee bit cramped. <laughs> Will you take the lighter oil? I mean, I guess. Okay, let's hope there's. Oh, hello! Yes, I will take the shotgun. Yes. Cases of drinking water. Okay, the guy down here should be almost dead, right? I wish I could flipping see. Oh god! Get off! Oh! Halt! Halt! Everybody halt! Freswar! Thank you so much for that beefy rain! Thank you, friend! Welcome, everybody! Raiders ahoy! The retroverts are here! <laughs> nice. Thank you, Freswar! How are you doing, sir? Everybody definitely needs to go... Follow Frasmar. Absolutely. Fantastic GOG streamer. 
And Kilgore is here too. Hello, Kilgore. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Resident Evil 3. <clears throat> Good timing because we just started this game. I just beat Resident Evil 2, and so I'm ending the stream with the start of Resident Evil 3. So, yeah, we've just been uh, learning how to play here. I'm still learning how to play. <clears throat> it's very different from the second game, so... Uh, I mean, not entirely, but it's it's very upgraded. There's lots of extra things. Thank you, Epic. Yes, and I am also Jill. So Jill here, Jill here, Jill everywhere. Did I meet com beat Commandos? No, I never beat Commandos. Great game, though. Really like it. How was your stream, Frazwar? So much Jilling. Rebecca! Yep. Re <laughs> Rebecca! <laughs> Thank you so much to Eye on You for five gifted subs. Nice. Hit some new dudes in there. Thank you so much, Eye on You. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. There's lots of pizza crumbs on the Cheese Chronomicon right now. <laughs> Don't tell anyone. You leave for one minute. <laughs> It was good. Beat an insane fight in Metal Gear 2 and an insane level in Dungeon Keeper 2. Hey, sounds like a really successful stream. Are the Metal Gear Solid games pretty hard? I, I've only heard, like, weird negative things about them. So I don't know what to think, but I, I've never played any of them. Are they, are they just, like, really strange or something? They have their moments. <laughs> okay. I'm not going to use my shotgun right now, I don't think. I think I can uh, live without doing that. Metagirl, you'd love its mega cheese? Oh, really? <laughs> Psycho Mantis can F off. <laughs> what? You rage quit Metal Gear Solid 1? Oh no. Fresmar! Woohoo! Thank you for the resub! Whoop whoop! Thank you so much, friend. And thank you again for the raid, too. Really appreciate it. Oh god, there's a dude at the thing! Did you see that? Wait. I. Look! In the upper left corner. Is that a bug? What is that? What the frick? I don't get it. What's he doing up there? Alright, you know, whatever. It's fine. That's me? What? What do you mean it's me? It's a clipping issue? Oh. I thought there was, like, a zombie coming down from a vent or something, and I was supposed to... <laughs> no, not that, you guys. Not me. <laughs> ha ha. He was trying to reach the cookie jar. I think he was. Okay, so, hold on. That door is locked. Uh, what did I just get? I got the shotgun. And I got some lantern oil. Lighter oil. So... I'm not sure where I'm trying to go. <laughs> I keep going into my inventory for map because that's just what I'm used to. Never heard anyone rage quit Metal Gear Solid before. <laughs> Leah, do you think you 
think love can flourish on the battlefield if you do play Metal Gear Solid? I mean, of course it can. What what better place to love for love to flourish than on the battlefield, right? Can I have one of these plants? Nothing unusual. Help! Uh, who's yelling help? Can I go this way? No, this is definitely blocked off. I heard someone say help! Oh wait, what about this? Is this the thing? Not a fan of console save systems, especially in sequences with four or five different sections that force you to start from the beginning. That's where, <laughs> that's what I was at, uh, let Resident Evil 2 in the beginning. Like when I played Leon, the first playthrough, it took me, uh, I don't know, 10 or so attempts, maybe even more than that, <laughs> from restarting at the beginning. But I got there in the end. And uh, I thought it was pretty, pretty great after that. Good pacing after the fact. Ugh. Itch. Judy! Thank you so much for the bits. Snake. Snake. Oh, is that the main character's name? Hey, Elfiend. Hi. Oh god. Ah! Get off me! You disgusting, disgusting person thing. Not, you don't even qualify as a person. Okay, I need to dodge more. Oh! Stomp his head! Stomp his head! Oh, she didn't even football punt his head. How disappointing. Alright, I'm at caution. I am now going to need to use a heal. I am all definitely gonna need to use a heal. Yikes. Okay. We're fine now. Don't worry. It's fine. Everything's under control. Can we go in here? It's locked from the other side. Of course it is. Uh. Oh, that doesn't sound good. The door to the boutique is locked. Oh god, somebody's getting munched on right now. Oh no. <laughs> oh, they're coming after me. Ah! Ooh. Hi. Jill, get up the thing. Ah! Oh wait, is that a map? Okay, you know what? Go away. Yes, please. <laughs> yes, please give me all the heals. Metal Gear discussion in our E stream, I'm feeling young again. <laughs> I mean, everyone here obviously has impeccable taste, so it's not surprising, right? Okay, that was just, uh, a loot thing. We need to go that way. Yeah, we do. Ugh! Stop it! Dang, nab it! Huh. I wonder if I could get all three of these guys in one shot. Think I could? <laughs> oh. Jump down. Go around. Ah, oh, frick! God, there's so many zombies. Okay, it's fine. Just go. Just run, Jill. 
Run for your life! Oh, I forgot the map. Tits. Alright, I guess we're gonna have to use more ammo. Hopefully they stay... Hi, Bella. I'm busy right now. Ugh. Yeah. Excuse me. Oh, they're gone. Okay, great. Uptown map. Uptown girls. That's what Jill is. She's just living in an uptown world. Ah! Oh, screw you, man. God, this game is hard. <laughs> Wah! This game's hard! Gotta head off and chow down on some beans and toast. Thank you so much, Frasmar. I really appreciate the raid, friend. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Everybody, make sure that you go give Frasmar a follow, okay? You will not regret it. <sighs> okay. Oh. Who's that? Sounds like a person with a gun. Oh my god, is that Brad Vickers? Oh Jesus. Okay, wait, wait, I'm not ready. Wait, I'm not ready, I'm not ready, I'm not ready. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's not a shotgun moment. You know, I feel like I should save the shotgun for those moments when I'm in deep shit. You know what, dude? Screw you. How are you not dead? Die! <sighs> okay. Bar. Nice. I was... Someone was drawing. So cute. Shutter is down. Uh-huh. Hello? This is Brad? It's my health. Yellow. Kill Brad, I love him. <laughs> Brad, hang in there. Why isn't someone doing it's something? It's Brad, you guys. I didn't know you were still alive, Jill. The police aren't trained for this kind of situation. What could they do? Listen, he's coming for us. We're both gonna die. What are you saying? You'll see. He's after stars members. There's no escape. <laughs> All right, bye then, Brad. <sighs> Thanks for being so damn subtle. All right. What's this? Partially consumed food and drinks. No, I mean this. Clock tower postcard. Ooh, picture postcard of a clock tower. The following explanation is printed on the back side. A landmark spot. St. Michael clock tower. Okay. Yeah, he seems like he's he's tired. Like he's he's flown one too many helicopter rides. 
Oh, good timing. I only had one left. Bottles of bourbon lie on the shelf. Okay. Yeah. I thought I saw a sparkle. I did. I did see a sparkle. You gotta have a lighter. Wouldn't be a Resident Evil game without a lighter. That's for sure. Someone's gotta have one. Anything else? Why hasn't the police force been trained to deal with zombie apocalypse? Uh, this game takes place directly after one, right? Like within hours after one, I think. Oops. Sorry, I just smacked you guys. Am I right about that? Months after? Oh, I thought it was directly after. Oh, okay. A few weeks or months have passed. Okay, I had to leave for a bit. See, we started Resident Evil 3. We did! Okay, so a month after. All right. One, oh, a day before Resident Evil 2. I got you, okay. But I was isolated in... One was isolated in the mansion, general public wasn't aware of it. Yeah, and then it wasn't until two when things went bonkers. So this is, like, right when that's happening. Or the day before. So they're just, like... They must be in the, in the first area where all the zombies were. And then it spread to uh, wherever Resident Evil 2 takes place. The next day. I came from there, so I go this way. Wait, no, I've been here too. Flip a dip! Aw, oh, come on, I dodged him. <sighs> okay, where are we going? Where are we going? Uh, we could go north. Yeah, oh, I can't get into there. I guess I'll get into here later. That's blocked off. Okay. Is there another way through here? And then north? Oops. Oh yeah. Where did you get the hat? I got it on Amazon, surprisingly enough. Now that doesn't sound good. Oh wait, I know what to do. I know what to do. R2? I can't see. Oh shit, how close do I have to be? Oh, I should have waited. Shit. <laughs> uh, it's okay, it's fine. Alright, you you get you get pistols. Alright, go. That could have been way cooler, but you know, whatever, you just you know, take what you can get. <laughs> oh no! That's okay. I bet we're gonna find a safe room soon. It's been bound tight with rope and won't open. The rope seems to be soaked with oil. Hey, really? Burn it. I can't use the lighter without- Oh, god damn it. That's what this is for. I see. Jeez. 
They really wanted to make three be a super survival-y crafty one. What happened to our clothes? It's, I, I mean, we have the theory that Jill was, uh, you know, on a prostitute undercover job when all this happened. Oh, that's a dog. Crap. I love how she has the, her sweater tied around her waist too. It's so 90s. Oh, hi, demon dog of hell and death. I don't even, I honestly, don't know how I actually did that. <laughs> Excuse me! <laughs> that dodge was a complete accident. Where am I? Uh. Crap. <laughs> I think I need to go back in there. Coffee. Well, let's explore this first, I guess. Hmm, very nice. I found the police department. Wait, if this takes place. If this takes place the day before, then why? This must be the same day. This is like the morning of, I, I bet, right? And then Resident Evil 2 starts in the evening on the same day because like Leon and Claire show up right as the zombie thing is happening too. Coffee! They didn't think it through a lot. Oh. Maybe Raccoon City was experiencing a heat wave and Jill is actually suitably dressed. <laughs> it's probably a few days before. It can't be a few days before. It's, it's gotta be the same day. Otherwise it doesn't make any sense. Loopholes. Alright, we gotta go back in here. Um, maybe it's the other side of town. No, because we just found Raccoon City PD, which is the same building that Leon and Claire are in. <laughs> in the cave. Raccoon is kind of isolated, so it's supposed to be a little hush-hush until Leon arrives. I see. All right, I'm gonna go try killing these doogies again. I don't want to use my. Okay, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna run for it here and try and go in here. Go in, go in. Look, can I go in the door? Thank you, God. Huh. <sighs> it's the '90s and shit happens. Oh, I found a safe room. Okay, great. Fabulous. Well, we need this, so let's eat it. Could I have tape? No? How rude. How rude, game. Gunpowder A and gunpowder A. Oh, gunpowder B. Ooh, well that will make shotguns, right? If I if I do A and B together. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Uh... I love how this knife, by the way, this knife looks like a sword. Is the knife any better in this game? Shotgun is B plus tool. Oh. <laughs> right. Okay. Uh, I want to. I want to make shotgun shells. Hmm. 
Yeah. Ah, yeah. RE3 takes place at a specific point in RE2 as far as the timeline is concerned. Oh yeah, Leon being able to get into the city even though they mentioned that the blockades out of every road into Reckon City is a big ploy hole. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Like, it doesn't make no sense. Alright, I guess I'll save. You can also do A plus A plus B to finalize the combination to get more shotgun, but using the A's. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, figure it out. Benny Stringbean, good night, sir. Have a lovely night. Blockades are necessary since PlayStation 1 can't handle much. Makes sense. These games look so good for being on PlayStation 1, though. I gotta say, they do look really nice. Okay. Uh, I guess we'll go dodge some more dogs. Doopadoo! That is a flaming demon dog, by the way, in case you didn't notice. Flaming demon dogs. Do 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 yeah. Alrighty then. Um, let's see. Went to the. Oh my god, the save rooms are marked with an S. I just realized that. That is so amazing. Holy butts. I say go to the bookstore, chill, and wait it out. <laughs> Good idea. Okay, I can't get through there. That's locked. I'll have to go the other way. Like behind me. Did I already search this whole area? I didn't try going in the police department. I don't think that's gonna work, but we'll try. Oh, it is gonna work. Oh, really? Oh my God. Oh my God. Sleeping? Okay, good. <laughs> First the mug thing and now this. I don't know if I don't know how much of this I can handle, you guys. Seriously. Actually, yeah, take that too. can't believe, also, why I can't believe I'm back here in this shithole. <laughs> I was just here. God damn it. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> it's fine. Remember what day it is. Oh yeah, that's right. It's all pretend. It's not real. April Fools. What? That? what? Stars card. Of course. Police station map. 
Oh god, game. <laughs> A typewriter! Ah! Seeing these old ones makes me want to play Dino Crisis. <laughs> Go for it! Prepared for Resident Evil 3 by removing the Brad mug. I see, I now see why you guys meant that the Brad zombie thing was a, was a spoiler. I didn't think he would actually be dead. Luckily, I thought it was just a silly thing. <laughs> it was like a, you know, oh no, I can't go in the save room. I don't have a chest? I don't have access to a chest? Seriously? Okay, whatever. Uh, well, I mean, I don't have a lot of things I can do in here, so go in here. Hi. This is Leon's desk, looking the same as ever. Someone has made quite a mess in here. Uh-huh. Oh, God. <gasps> Will Smith! Why? The RPD officer Marvin Brenag. Yeah, it's him. He's been fatally wounded by zombies. He appears to be holding something in his hand. Wait. Okay, wait, wait, wait. If he's already dead, then doesn't that mean that this takes place after he's alive? Fatally wounded means dead, you guys. Right? <laughs> does it mean he's dead? <laughs> This means that it has to take place after Leon was here. <sighs> September 24th. There are reports of a theft in the municipal building before dawn. A jewel decorated clock at the main gate was damaged. Two of the 12 gems that are installed at the face of the clock are missing. 12? Due to the lack of available officers at this time, I have no choice but to suspend the research of this case. Signed, Marvin Bernag. Based upon the autopsy report of 42-year-old restaurant owner, uh, I have discovered that he has one of the missing gems. Uh, he apparently took shelter in the police department at about 10 a.m. where he was shot to death within 10 minutes of having developed the symptoms. Since the city is currently under martial law, we are forced to suspend this case. At this time, we'll keep the... Gem as evidence. Signed, Marvin Bernal. Okay, Marvin. He's dead, you guys. He's he's dead. Also, there's no safe in here. Wasn't there? Wasn't this the room with the safe in it? No, that was a different. No, that was a different room. Never mind. Sorry. Oh my god. My brain is gonna hurt after this, isn't it? Hi, are you gonna come to life? I'd rather you didn't. Ah! Why do they take away the punting their heads off thing? That was so great. Put that back in the game, I need it. I need that, it's the thing I need. Can I just express how unhappy I am to be back in the same areas that I was just in? <laughs> I'm sure like when you play this game a few years after two, you're probably like, yay, we're back in the police station. <laughs> it's so great. I love this place. I remember this. Okay, found the gem, but I don't have any inventory space, so. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I need a I need a save room. I feel happy. It's 
locked with a number base lock. Two. Two. This will be hilarious if this works. It'll be so hilarious. Oh, there's no six. Damn it. <laughs> Five. Shit. Uh, that would be so great, though. Um. Okay. Uh, well, they're gonna have to give me a safe here. Because otherwise... Okay, there's a safe room right there. Let's do it. Wow, you're a cool looking lady zombie. Hi there. Excuse me. Oh, Jesus. Pardon me. Coming through. Coming, coming uh, through. <laughs> Whoop de doop de doo. I remember being here like it was yesterday. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's put this away and. I don't know. There's too much stuff. This game has too much stuff in it. Why does this have to take up an inventory space? Do, do I need to put that away for now? Maybe I need to maybe I need to not carry that with me. I don't know. Okay, wait. Let's do that last. Remember the closed locker in this room? If you do the Brad thing into and kill him, he drops the key to open it. Oh, really? That's so depressing. Why would you ever kill Brad? Whoever whoever did that is it is should be put in jail. If you did that Easter egg, you should you should not be allowed to play any other Resident Evil games ever in your whole life. It's just sacrilege. It's immersive. <laughs> My sanity is at its end. I still can't believe this is happening. We lost another man yesterday. Mayor. One of our better marksmen. He saw me panic once we were overrun by the zombies, but he came back to save me. But when the time came to return the debt, I ran. I could still hear him calling out my name. I could still hear the screams coming from behind. The sound of the flesh being stripped from my bones. I was afraid. Terrified. The fight to stay alive continues. I took out several zombies and managed to break through the barricades. Now I'm cutting through the chill with whiskey, unloading my Mossberg on anything undead. That shotgun's become a close friend of mine. I've blasted many a zombie into fertilizer with it. Uh, we've lost 13 men as of yesterday. In three hours, we'll, we'll bicker over trivial things in the meeting room. It's a total waste of time. When I finish the bottle, my old friend Mossberg will be turning and hit one last body into fertilizer. Peace at last. I can hardly wait. David's memo. Wow, the writing is sure a lot more American, I guess. I don't know how else to say that without sounding like a dick. Uh, yes. Nope, turns out there's nothing special in here, Yogso. Turns out all that was in there the whole time was some gunpowder A, all right? That's, that's it. That's the only thing that's in there. Um. <laughs> uh, we are in two. We are. It's the same room. <laughs> uh, I don't know what I'm doing. Did I already save? I didn't save yet, right? I don't think I did. There, there, I don't... This is too much stuff. There's just too much stuff, okay? How am I supposed to deal with all this? I'm just gonna put this away. Go away. 
And also you go away. I don't need you right now. I'll just take my plants with me. And then I'll save. I don't think I did save in the main hall. I'm pretty sure I didn't. Uh, well, maybe I did. I don't know. No, I did not. Aha! Uh because -huh. I didn't have any ink ribbons. Because there was no box. Okay. I'm really mad. I'm really mad that uh, Brad only stayed alive for like two seconds. I'm pretty pretty disappointed by that. I'm just gonna save that gunpowder, I think, so I can make more shotgun thingies later. Do I actually have a notification? No. Alright, anything in here that we need to know about? Any cool pictures? Nothing suspicious! Nah, -uh, game, that's wrong. This is where photos can be developed, remember? A saucy pick of Wesker? Hell yeah. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, it's probably best that we, uh... You know, deal with a couple of these anyway, because they're right by the save room. So, up above here was the puzzle. I wonder if it'll let us go up there. I would question why there is a loose gunpowder in a police station. I assume the police bought all their shelf cartridges. <laughs> because, don't you know that Jill Ballantyne likes to craft all of her ammo from scratch? She doesn't like using ammo that's like, you know, already created. It has to be fresh. Oh, come on. Ah, oh, come on! Oh, God. Stupid zombies. Out of my way! Is this actually? Doorknob turns, but the door won't budge. It seems to be nailed from the other side. How are the? How come the statues are gone? How come? Who had time to remove the statues? I call shenanigans on so many things in this police department. <laughs> I think it was all just a fever dream that Leon had. Like Resident Evil Two didn't even. It wasn't even really a thing that happened. He's just like dreaming of being a part of the police department. And he's like, what if I woke up one day and there's a zombie apocalypse and I saved everyone and I fell in love with Ada and everything was just glorious. But it really, that didn't happen. It was just all in Leon's mind. Cause he just like wants a girlfriend like that bad. This is what really happens. Jill and Brad saved everyone except Brad. Rip Brad. Forever. Rip Brad. <sighs> Chief Iron's messing up the police station before Leon and Claire get there. Yeah, maybe. I think I need to get into here, because they need... No, wait, I need the star's key to unlock that? God. I thought I would get the star's key inside the star's office. Oh my god, do I have to go loot Brad? Oh. I hope not. That's sad. Okay, there's another dude over here, though. I'm just gonna use a pistol if I need to. No! No, you fat... Stupid zombie! Get off! Very angry at all the zombies in this game. When are we getting a Brad Netflix series? <laughs> I hope soon. Hashtag soon. Excuse me. <laughs> I mean, if Leon was dealing with Ashley at the time when he thought of all 
the events in RE2, then yeah, I wouldn't blame him. Do you like Ashley? You mean Ada? Oh no, more zombies. Get him, Jill. You're an Amazon, Jill. That's what Brad would say. Okay. Punch his head. How am I doing on health? Caution. Oh boy. A twofer. Stay down. Good grief. Oh, oh, Holt. Dreams of fragile. Thank you so much for the raid, friend. Hello, hello. How are you doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome. What were you playing in your stream? Thank you. Appreciate it. It's double Jill right now. Some Jill on Jill action. You heard it here, folks. I found the stars card! <laughs> Don't think about that too much because then it starts sounding really like messed up in a bad way. I'll just leave it as it is. Good night, Gibberator. Did I? I definitely did not search that whole room. Definitely not. <sighs> let's, let's check out this sweet card. It's mine. An ID card for stars with Jill's picture on it. Why did I just leave my card in the flippin' lunchroom? No, this is like a classroom, isn't it? Also, what in the heck? Is that picture right here? It's really pixelated, but it looks like a lady in a bathing suit. Uh, so far, I have, I've only encountered him once, and I ran away like a pansy. I mean, I bravely ran away. I, I, that's, I've only had to do that once, so, you know. I didn't know that I would have to do it again. Uh, okay, I guess I did get everything in here, but what about this? Yes, I will take some shotgun shells. There's nothing you can do with the fireplace. Thank you so much for letting me know that. I was gonna go back and get my lighter and try to set some shit on fire, but now I know. <laughs> Game was like, there's nothing to do here. Go away. Don't try and do the same puzzles three times. Bravely run away like Henry in Kingdom Come. That's right. Okay, I came from this way. So we need to keep going. Hello! Jill is such a good shot. She never misses. Except when she really needs to not miss and then she misses. Anything else going on? Oh god, stop that. Stop that. 
Really? There's nothing here? Sturdily barricaded, eh? Hmm. Nice word choice. God, you mean I just wasted bullets on that guy? Oh, come on, game. Fine. Didn't even get anything. That's so rude. <sighs> blurry, blurry, blurry. He's just chilling. <laughs> He's not bothered. Exiled deity, hello. All right, stars. I have it. Use it, Jill. What? What? Is this not it? Is it a different stars card? Oh. Our stars key? Ah! What are we, Flip. Okay, fine. What do I open with this then? Look, the pressure plate's still here, but the, uh... Statues are gone. I guess Irons came in like he must have removed all the statues in his rage. Oh, you're gross! Get out of my camera. <laughs> he doesn't even care anymore. <laughs> Thank you for following, Dreams Are Fragile. Okay, go around you, go back in here. I still don't have space. I still don't have space. I don't want to combine those two. I guess I could combine this, this. No, I can't. Okay. Uh... Okay. Uh. Hang on. I'm going to go I'm going to go back to the save room. <laughs> Put these away. I don't know what that's for yet. I guess I'll put it away. Uh, or maybe we're gonna need it immediately. Actually, oh wait. Uh, yeah, we can combine that with that. Yeah, we probably are gonna need it immediately. Let's just take a minute. Okay. Now, whoop. now I can pick up a couple things. I will take the blue gem. I don't know what I need it for, but I will take it. Map on the wall? Where? I don't- I can't get into this, right? No.
Oh, there was one in the save room? Are you sure? Ah, <clears throat> uh, butts. Yeah, there must, I mean. When in doubt, ask Brad. Yes. Hello? This is Brad! <laughs> no, you have to do a lot of stuff to get things done in this game. Definitely not, uh... I mean, the speedruns of this game are really cool. Don't get me wrong. I've, I've watched some speedruns of this game, but... It takes a lot of things to do things. A lot of things to do all the things in this game, and uh... Oh yeah, there's a map apparently on the wall? Where? Uh... No. No, there's not a map on the wall, liar. Oh. <sighs> God damn it. Okay, I'll just go. Whatever. She's at yellow, I think. She's fine. Fine until a lurker comes in to murder me. Hi. Uh. Alright, let's try using this card on the computer and see if we get anywhere. Yes! Due to the emergency, the key to the star's office has been moved to the evidence room. Ah, there we go. 4001. That's what we need. Okay. And I'm not gonna save yet. It's fine. Brad is eminent. Ah, <laughs> oh, dang it. Come on, zombie. Do 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 Opposite the stairs where the conversation room is. Now that's a police key. That's a key right there. The password is random, so different in each playthrough. Oh, wow, that's cool. Nice touch. Okay, I gotta dodge this zombie a couple more times here. Yep. I was wondering if I should have put some more stuff away because I'm gonna have to pick some shit up in here. Oh, I think I'm gonna put the gem away, maybe.
I still have this card, too. Am I gonna need that? Okay, well, that gives me two spaces, so whatever. <sighs> the big whiteboard outside the save room. But what? No, I think I... Please do not leave the dark room. I know, I know what area he's talking about. I just have to go back up there. I mean, the conversation room was the room that was up here. Uh, or no, wait. No, it was down there. That room. On the, uh, yeah. Oh, I can't scroll on these maps. Damn. Top left is the conversation room, anyways. Do, 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 do. To the store's office! Oh, man, I'm so sleepy today. <laughs> I apologize for being so sleepy. Let's go in, Jill. Yes, I do need to use the star's key right now. Jill. There we go. Saw sparkly on my desk. Jill, take your hat. Oh my god, that would be so awesome if she took her hat and put it on. That would, like, make my day. Yes? No! Why is it going in my inventory? Ugh! God. Chris. This organization probably reflects the owner's personality. Stupid Chris. So disorganized. I will take the bullets. It's the desk of Wesker, captain of the stars. That's really weird that Jill would say that because isn't he like extremely dead right now and also evil? <laughs> So clearly, he's no longer Captain of the Stars. I mean, I hope so. I hope you still don't want him as Captain of the Stars, Jill. A large communications device. It's out of commission. I can't send any messages from here. How about a heal? Great. the desk of Rebecca. Rebecca! A rookie member of the stars. Oh, God. Uh, <laughs> I can't carry it. Why is my lockpick in my inventory? It's never been this way. Uh, I need that. Hello? No. Come to anyone. Our platoon is cut off. No survivors found. This is Carlo. Send in support unit immediately. Colonel what? Colonel Brad? Colonel Brad Mark II? Okay. Well... I know, right? She used to be the master of lockpicking, and now she just... Now she's just, uh, not. <laughs> now she's just not. Okay, uh, well, I have to go back again, and then back one more time, because now I have too much stuff again, so... Uh, that's the wrong way. <laughs> boop, boop, <Brad. laughs> Hello? This is Carlos. <laughs> Was it, does he say Colonel Carlos? 
I didn't hear what he said. Colonel something. Shit. Uh oh. That sounded like a bunch of zombies coming in through the window. I didn't like the sound of that. Maybe the Carlos mug can be the white one. Ah! Did you just punch me in the back of the head? God. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> He's like, surprise, punch rocket launcher. <laughs> oh my God. <sighs> <laughs> that is so rude. Right. Okay, right. So here, here's what we're gonna do. This time I'm gonna have enough inventory space. Um... Wait, I don't think I need that. Uh, what do I actually need is the question. Am I dead right now? No, I'm, f I'm actually fine right now. Okay. I'll keep this. This is good. Three spots. Dad the noob! Thank you for the cheesy bits, friend. Nemesis ain't playing around. He is not... Uh, yeah, we'll just take this for now. Oh my god, I'm sorry. Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I need to get more sleep tonight. <laughs> oh god, I haven't killed you yet. Okay, now you're dead. Congratulations. Okay, where are we even? Did I... Okay, I haven't been up there yet. We have to go into that room... Yeah, okay. Let's go into this room. Was there anything at the end of that hallway? I can't remember. I'm maybe I could just skip it. Ink ribbon. Stars card. Okay, just a whole lot of disappointment. Great, then I'm just not even gonna go there. That stuff. See you later, zombies. Quick stop here again. We will be much more efficient this time, you guys. Much more efficient. I hope. <laughs> All right. Uh, we don't need to save right now. I'm going to be picking up a gem. Well... I'm gonna use this. Hmm. 
think I'm actually gonna put this away for now. That should help a wee bit for just for a sec. Yeah. The card apparently stays in my inventory, which is why it's kind of a bummer. Oh, come on! Stupid lady. Oh, God damn it. All those times I got past her flawlessly. All those times. Ripperonies. Take this. Drop it? It doesn't have any use after the computer? Four zero one one. That's the same code. Did you know that it only takes dedication to be a zombie? But I'm psh <laughs> nice, good one, Judy. <sighs> Boop. Okay, gonna scooch by. I'll just put it in my box. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna throw it away. No! Ugh. Oh no, your shoes don't work, Silverleaf? Is it just because you need to break them in or are they just really bad? Jill could have saved Marvin. You know, she maybe could have, yeah. Excuse me, ma'am. Doop! Wrong chat. Oh. <laughs> I thought you came back to complain about your shoes. Would have been legit. I guess... Thematically, it makes sense that Jill doesn't discard her own card before it never was Leon or Claire's stuff when they were discarding things. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Just inventory space is rough in this game, man. Alright, uh... We'll save now. think it was always the stuff that they had found like Marvin scarred to use computer in Leon's case yeah that's true but Leon was a rookie so he didn't have any of his own cool stuff in the star's office and we're probably going to use the healing item after before we find nemesis oh I haven't been up here yet at all eeps eeps it eeps it eeps 
Okay, let's just, uh... Are you guys gonna come down the stairs? Are you able to do that? You are. Oh, you're actually... That didn't work very well at all, actually. Oh, goodness. Um. <clears throat> Don't shoot zombies on the stairs, I guess. Yes, it was his, literally his first day on the job. Yep. <laughs> Excuse me, pardon me, come in. Oh god, pardon me. What happened to the fat guy? He's not here this time? Oh, there he is. <laughs> Yeah, there is at his desk, um, there's party hats and stuff. It's pretty cute. Okay, I've got space now. What? No, I wanted the Magnum. What? Pickups are random too? What? No! I wanted the Magnum! I really did want the Magnum. Shit! Um. Oh well. Fat zombie was on his second coffee donut break. Yes, he was. A few guns and enemies are randomized. I mean, I guess that's kind of cool. Okay, I think I had exactly enough space. We're at yellow. Uh, let's get past these zombies before we... Before we heal. You didn't remember that when you played decades ago and played dozens of times? Always the Magnum for you? Damn it, I wish I got the Magnum. <laughs> I was I was looking forward to that. you not be dead. Okay. We're gonna use that. And then we'll see what happens. Hi! How many times do I gotta shoot you to make you go away? <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> wow, she took a rocket launcher to the face! She was fine! Gok Zara, thank you so much for the host, friend. I'm out of Le Boulettes. Le Boulettes. I'm trying to I'm trying to shoot this guy. Get him, Jill. Get him, Jill. I believe in you. I believe in you, Jill. Oh, you're missing. Jill, you're missing. Yeah. He's not dead, is he? Nope. How did I know? I should have ran away. <laughs> I regret everything. Stairs. Hello? This is Brad. Uh. Oh. 
There we go. Okay. What happened? <laughs> the game like froze. <laughs> I don't know if I wanna. Ow. Quit being such a jerk. Can you even kill him? Is it possible? Gosh, I don't know if that's worth it. I have to use like all of my ammo. You can't, every time he appears, you can kill him. Mm. You better fade the magnum, I could kill him. <laughs> Resident Evil. Resident Evil. I don't think it's worth it. I'm probably not gonna try to do that again. Okay. But, interesting. Crap, he saw me. Oh, I just... I didn't mean to do that. Oh, God. Go. Just go. Does this change the story? Is that what you mean? I mean, I think if I was use, if I was playing on easy... I would definitely do it. Maybe I'll get the Magnum this time. Yay, I did! Woohoo! What about what about ammo for the Magnum though? First aid spray. Hopefully I can uh, like craft that too and stuff. Oh god. <laughs> Don't mind me, just uh, taking a detour around the desk. A skirt? It looks like a skirt to me. But it is the 90s, so... Maybe it is a squirt. A squirt! It's the most expensive to make. Okay. Well, we'll just use it for when we need to shoot people in the face really, really badly. You don't get benefits from beating him on easy. It's weird how they did it. Oh. They want you to they want you to like really suffer if you manage to beat him, huh? Okay. So, um, 
Do I want to run into the save room? Or do I want to go... Or just run away from him? Because I'm going to run away from him. Bye! Wow, that was way better. <laughs> he didn't even get a rocket launcher off in my face that time. I bet he didn't even know where I went. Alright, uh... Gosh, I don't know. I guess I'll put the magnum away for now. And, uh, just carry those with me. Do I have any other heals? Nah. <sighs> Fine. <laughs> Whoa, hi, Nemesis guy it does really you know it does really suck that the it, you know what sucks generally in this game everything's in my inventory my lockpicks in my inventory the gun i have equipped is in my inventory i have additional things like crafting materials <laughs> see you later uh, <laughs> I just hope the game's gonna let me craft bigger bags or something. Okay. Uh. Bye. Okay, hold on. I think I have to go. Yeah, the final one. I don't know how you would do that. You could stab him 90 times. You'd have to be really good at avoiding getting hit. <sighs> so what are we even, where are we even going now? I got a gem and yeah, like what? I'll just leave, I guess. Do I leave the police station now? <laughs> Is this the, did I get the one out of the 12 gems that I found at the police station? Is that why I'm here, to get the gem? Uh, cause there's nothing else to do, so I guess I'll just go. Oh right, there was locked doors. Yeah, I could open the locked doors. <sighs> All right, outies. Bye, Raccoon City PD. It's been fun, kind of. <laughs> kind of sick of that place, but no offense. No offense meant. It's a great police department. Great, beautiful building. It's just gorgeous. But you know, just uh, been there too many times. Also, it's a very sad location where my best friend and ultimate crush died. Okay, I think I'm gonna go save in here. And hopefully I don't get eaten by the dogs. Well, I try to do that. Brad got bored and left. Yeah, yeah, that's what happens. That's absolutely what happened. He got, he just got bored. Of course. Oh, right. Hmm. 
places white roses in bread mug. Oh. Brad is working on a rescue helicopter again. <laughs> He's working on that big, bright rescue helicopter in the sky. <laughs> He's walkie-talkie and in the great chopper in the sky. Exactly. And <laughs> shoplifter too. Ah! Don't forget to check out books and coffee before leaving Raccoon City and <laughs> remember to stay alive. Books, everybody! Coffee! <laughs> hey, at least they're right to the point, right? And gallery as well. We need to find bullets! <laughs> yeah. I would go there. I'd definitely shop there. Oh, uh, hello? Hello? Is this a splosive or a climby? Splosive, I think. Whoa! No! Thank you, sorry, Bob. I saw that, I did. Oh, I saw that. You guys know what that was? Stars bucks? Oh, nice. <laughs> nice. Oh my god, that was a liquor. Oh boy. Okay, um. What's this? There's a fire hydrant of fire hoses fixed with bolts. Okay, what you want? What you want me to find a freaking screwdriver or a bolt thing or what? Okay, Jill wants that fire hose. I can tell. She really wants that fire hose. We gotta get it for her. Hello, plants. Oh my God! Why is there so many damn plants? What do you want me to do, game? I don't have any inventory space. Like, seriously, am I going to be poisoned? Am I supposed to just be taking one set of guns? Is that my problem in this game? I got to leave all that. Okay, everybody remember that there's some healing in this long hallway, okay? Right here in this middle thing. <laughs> Yeah, bolt thing wrench. Yeah, that. Ooh. Oh, God. I hear some squishy noises as well. Where am I right now? Okay, there is a door to go here. Ooh. Have I been in the sales office? I don't think I have. Because it's not, it's not green. That means I haven't been there, right? Whoa! Good thing we can still take out the dogs in the same way. Hello, sir? I mean, sure, why not? I'll take the gunpowder.
Jill could have had more inventory space, but she would have to wear pants. Yeah, that must be why. <laughs> Hello? Oh, I don't like the sound of that. Oh, it's just a doogie. Okay. Never mind. I thought it was going to be a liquor. No problem, Bob. It seems to be a charging the battery. You can't carry any more items. Why do I want that? Jill, go up the ramp. Oh, you don't want to go up the ramp? Fine, be that way. You want to look in there? That looks like cool stuff to look at. Dang it. <laughs> it seems that there is no power for it. Okay. Good. It's exactly what I need right now. All right. We're going to store this uh, for now. I think I could make some more shotgun shells, I guess. That is kind of like what I need. Yeah. Wasn't she wearing pants in the first one? Yes, she was wearing pants and like a whole, she had like a t-shirt on and a hat and she was fully clothed in the first game. She also had long hair in the first game. Parking lot. Huh. I wonder if I could get away with leaving my lockpick for a bit. Oh, there's tape right there. The Jill sandwich experience changed her. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. that to be there either. Gotta organize. Okay, now we actually have some space. Anything else in here? Uh, 
was awesome! Yeah! Oops. Is that something? I gotta go back and get that, uh... Before I forget, I'm gonna go get that, like, cable thing from the car. Oh. Oh, these are just, like, unpoison yourself herbs. Cool. That needs power. Yeah, whoever's charging their cable, their car, they're not gonna need it, right? They're not gonna need it. I don't know what I need that for. I probably need to find a room with power and fix it because it's probably broken. Yeah, the long hallway plants. I'll get those. I think I probably have to go back that way. Maybe. Uptown. Yeah. Oh, I can't scroll around unless I'm there. Oh, man. Whatever. Okay. I'll have to remember that. That, are you sure that's not a thing? Okay. Take car, leave city, and art puzzle behind. <laughs> Sounds good to me. All right, there's a map there. There's a locked door there. Okay. Yay, for more maps! Oh, God. Restaurant. Newspaper office, gas stuff, and trolley. Okay. Oh, it's a hanging thingy. What the frick is that? Oh no. That does not look like a liquor. Ugh. Gross. Oh, bleh. Oh god, there's another one. Oh my god. What the frick? No, I don't actually know. I don't want that. But yeah, I'll take it. This ex his expression shows insane agony and pain. I'm not sure that's the right word, but okay. Yeah, those are not liquors. Those are like way worse. Yuck. <laughs> Demon grasshopper things. Sorry, I think I just smacked you guys again. There's a slot into which a battery can be set. Okay, we need a battery. Sure, all right, cool. Oh my god. Man. I have a feeling this game is way more gross than the last game. I mean, I can already tell that it's gonna be. Is what I mean to say. Oh, 
I'm wondering something about this floaty uh, doohickey. Like, can we do something? Like, shoot it? Cool. Does that just... Is that just allow me to, like, land it on my enemies? I feel like a bullet would do more damage than a crate. But what do I know? Brad, is that you? Oh my god. Oh, jeez. Uh, place your wisdom here. There's a hollow space for something to be put in. What? The future is our in our hands. Will you take the bronze compass? Yes, I guess. What have I done? I see. Okay. I see. Well, we're right by the rest out rot. There's also a save room right there. I think we should try getting to that save room. And also maybe go get the lock pick. Okay, wait, that's the lift. That's Is this the thing that needs the battery, right? I wish I could make notes on the map. Substation. Ugh. We must channel our knowledge to the future, for it shall always show our greatest destiny. <laughs> Raccoon City Mayor Michael Warren, what a wise gentleman. Let's see, let's go, um, I kind of want to go to this save room. I'm going to have to end the stream soon. I don't know if I want to go into the restaurant right now because I have too much stuff. But I guess I could always go back. It's not that big of a deal. Hello? Is anyone here? Uh, dear citizens, thanks to kind and generous people of Umbrella Inc. This is a peaceful and friendly city. The vast donations from Umbrella Inc. have been used for welfare work, the construction of public utilities, and to help maintain public peace. In 1992, it was my fifth year as mayor of our beautiful city. It was then that through many donations of hard work, our city was able to rebuild the municipal building, create a state-of-the-art hospital. In honor of these fine accomplishments, I was awarded with a grand statue this, that, that same year. The statue rests in the municipal building. I came to the city as an engineer more than 35 years ago. I made contributions to the electric systems and to the installation of the cable car. I pledge to follow the tradition of this fine city and will donate my life to its prosperity. The mayor of the city, Michael Warren. All right, so the mayor is also working for Umbrella. Calling it right now. He turns into a zombie eventually. And we have to blow his head off. Hello. I don't believe we've met. Can I please tell me these can stack? What? No. Please tell me those can stack. Oh. Oh, that's how you do it. Okay. 
So you just make them double. You make them double A's. I get it. Okay. Nothing suspicious. I'm gonna lurk for the remainder of the stream. Wanna make more progress on my game. Did you did you say what game you were playing, Silverleaf? Did I just forget? I probably forgot. I'm sorry. I know I asked you and then I probably forgot what you said. Even the people who aren't working for Umbrella are probably working for Umbrella anyways. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Persona 5 Royale. Ah, okay. Have a good time, Silverleaf. What the frick is that? It seems to be a switch for the drain. Uh-huh. That looks like um, it's going to blow up. Heavy looking cover. There's a hole to hook something into. <gasps> you mean a manhole hook? What was it called again? <laughs> a manhole tool? <laughs> Can I shoot that? I mean, that's my first instinct. Is it, is it correct? No. Okay. I thought either... Oh, it is flammable gas. Okay. Well, it's probably going to blow up at some point. It's locked with a simple lock. Well, too bad I don't have my lockpick because I'm stupid. It's fine. We're going to go to the save room. Go to the save room and then come back. Manhole opener. That was it. Yeah. Manhole opener hype. <laughs> ah! Shoot! Wish it shoot, shoot, shoot! Why you don't shoot? Why you don't shoot? Oh god. Okay, switch to this. Get some more shoot these, shoot the action on. Uh oh. Whoa! Excuse me, Mr. Beefcake Zombie. Excuse you. Holy crap. Okay, where the heck is the save room? Right here. Alright. <laughs> yeah, that guy was super strong, zombie. Actually, let's put weapons up here. Uh, lockpick. Nope. <laughs> nope. Lockpick. There we go. And you. And what are you? Gas? It's our friend, the crank! Heck yeah. Don't know what you're far for yet, Mr. Crank, but I'm sure that you will be useful eventually. <laughs> Zombies must be adding pre-workout and protein into their diet. Yeah. I think they are. Beefy zombies. Okay, put these back. I think I'm gonna actually go back and get those herbs and leave this. Hopefully that doesn't bite me in the bum. 
Did I save? Wait, did I save? You guys, did I just save or not? My brain is slowly dying after playing this the entire day. Okay, thank you, Yagzo. <laughs> I was like, wait a second. Wait a second. Okay. Let's do it. Okay, now we're gonna go back to the restaurant and get the rest of that stuff. And I also want to go back and get that healing before I forget it's there. Yes. It's a Krober! It's the manhole! It's the same exact graphic as the manhole opener. Literally identical. This time it's a fire hook, though. Fire hook, guys. Not manhole opener. Not crowbar. It's a fire hook. Right? Don't you mistake it. <laughs> That's no fire hook. Alright, did I miss anything else in here? Uh, you know what I'm gonna need? I bet I'm gonna need the cable. I think I got everything else. Let's just go down in the, th in the thingy ma ding ding. Eh. Yeah! Go, Jill! What's that? Calm down, lady. I'm no zombie. My name's Carlos, Corporal of Umbrella's <laughs> Biohazard Countermeasure Force. It is Carlos. What's your name? Jill, did you just say you belong to Umbrella's army? Yeah. We came all the way out here to save you civilians. But the mission went bad the minute we landed. Oh, no. How did he find me? Run into the basement. Hide inside the kitchen. Basement. This way. He'll never find us down here, Carlos. Carlos the Latino hunk. Oh, yeah. Uh oh. I guess we better get a move on, Carlos. Is there any. This chest has been ripped in into and torn apart. You know what really sucks is that I decided not to bring healing with me because I was like. I was like, yeah, you know, I'm just gonna go get those, uh. Those, uh, you know. I, you know. <laughs> Apparently I'm from Canada right now. Uh. So, Carlos. Follow me. Oh. But we just came from there, Carlos. I'm confused. Oh! Jill! Oh, I got it. Okay. Uh, I'm just, okay, bye, Carlos. See you later. Good luck, man. Oh, he's fine? Wait, what? I what? need to ask you something. Why did Umbrella send your team here? Our mission is to rescue the civilians. How kind of you. Considering Umbrella caused all this in the first place, those liars! Look, we're just mercenaries. Hired hands. No time for talking. If you can believe me, then join us. Think about it. If you give me that gun, I'll think about it. Oh 
god. Oh god. Jill. Jill. Go, Jill. Ah! No! <laughs> oh, you asshole. Oh, I was right there. <laughs> no, it was right there. God damn it. Alright. Oh. I think we're gonna call it a stream there. Anyways, guys. I said I was gonna go till 7 and it's almost 7.30. So this nemesis douchebag is just gonna be basically following me the whole game, huh? I don't like him very much, you know? He's not, he's not very nice. getting dork. It's very dork. All right, so uh, tomorrow is a recording day, so I won't, I won't be live. But on Friday, we will be playing the crap out of this game all day. So hopefully you guys would like to join me again on Friday. I don't usually stream on Friday, but um, the stream got a little messed up this week because of various releases and what not, because I had to record Mountain Blade on Monday, and because Resident Evil 3 is coming out tomorrow. So the plan, in case I, in case you're new here, you didn't hear me say it earlier, I'm going to be finishing Resident Evil 3 ASAP. Then I'm going to be playing 3 Remastered immediately after. Then after that, we're going to be playing 1 Remastered, and then 2 Remastered. So it's going to be... Basically a crap load of Resident Evil this month. Depending on whether or not I'm getting sick of it, I might take like a day or two break to play something else here and there. But generally, I would like to finish the whole series in April. So that's the plan. Re Resident April. Yeah. Basically, Kilgore. Lots and lots of Resident Evil. So it should be a good time. I'm really looking forward to seeing um, the remakes. It's going to be really fun, I think. Exciting and fun and very scary. He says one word. Stars. <laughs> two down, two thousand more to go. Welcome back, Dragon Crux. What an awesome stream it's been, though. So much fun, especially RE3. Thanks for the stream. Thank you, Hard Driver. Have a good night. Everybody, uh, thank you so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for all the support today at the stream. It was so nice. Thank you for the gifted subs. Promise I will get hard at work on those emotes. And hopefully I can have at least one or two of them done by next week. Hopefully. I mean, I should be able to. They shouldn't be that hard. But I, I have, I'm using a new software for it. So I'm hoping that I can figure all of that out ASAP. I'm pretty excited because I'm going to be doodling them on my iPad with my new little pen thing. And, uh, yeah, if you're in the Discord, I'll probably be sharing some of my drafts in there to, to make sure you guys like them. But I'm going to do the, uh, well, we'll have a Brad one, probably Walkie Talkie, or, uh, no, and Broken Ankle and Raising Hands. Those are the three we're going to work on. And then eventually also Pizza... And there's some other ones. That was, was that the only other one? Pizza and, oh, scratching chin thinking is another one. <laughs> but yeah, I'm sure there's some other ones too. Looking forward to that. Thank you guys so much for all the support. Oh, we're going to raid somebody too. So first though, first, like we always do. Um, okay, we're going to stop. No. Okay, you know what? That's fine. No, it's not actually. It's not fine. Start. I should have just paused and did the credits here. Okay. Can we do load game? Resident Evil. Credits. <clears throat> Good enough. <laughs> Good enough. 
I should have a screen. I need to make a scene specifically for credits is what I need to do. I need to do that. I will do that. Thank you so much, user copy to pasty again, by the way, who bought my pizza today and then some. Thank you guys so very, very much for that. It's delicious. Can't wait to eat more as soon as I'm done with the stream. Magic Cookie, Judy, user, Lunatic Chef, Benny Stringbean, are so well. Copy to pasty. Uh, Jelly Canuck, only one twitching. Dad the noob. Kirkland. Craig, Vadim, Not Automaton, Hey Peaks Production, Pulsinator, thank you guys so much for the bits, appreciate it very, 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 very much, and thank you to all of you awesome people for the hype train earlier and just all the support <clears throat> in general, you guys are the best, thank you. Thank you to my moderators, once again, you guys are the best, there were some Iffy comments today, saw some stuff get deleted, so I appreciate that for protecting me from the spoilers. Thank you so much. Um, and sometimes more than that. New followers. Matthias, dreams are fragile. C. Lewis, blue pierced pixie. Shaw, Timothy 10, Huffu, Deadpool, Darkwing Drake, Dr. Dimmy123, Mega Mika, Nico Bonetti, Paladin of Candlekeep, Sandro, Centuria, thank you guys for following. 